Hey, it's the Knockaround here, and I am going to continue the race to 100 mil with my alpha character. So what I'm thinking of doing, because I really um, want to try something a little bit different, I am going to try to do the Sisters of Eve arc. So I need to get a ship, and I, in the process of training up Destroyer, but um, I'm not there yet. I will probably have to use some skills to get there. Some of my skill points. So I am thinking. Nope, not that one. This one here. Now, the only thing I've got to train up is destroyer. But this one here. Maybe. Let's see here. There we go, 113 DPS, not bad. I have trained up the skills for the Enforcer and the um, Soldier of Fortune, the suggested skill plans for those. That's what I've trained up so far. And I think this is what I'm gonna go ahead and use. Um, now I will need to experiment with some different charges, so. I'm going to go ahead and see if there is a better fit. So I am going to pause this while I take a look. A few minutes later. All right. So I think this is going to be the best fit. I went ahead and adjusted the ammo a little bit. Got some different types of ammo. So let us see how much this is going to cost. Now I currently have. Four thousand, four million and twenty-two thousand, and this is gonna take just about all of it. But you know what? You only live once. So let's go ahead and buy, and we have everything that we need. So actually, let's go ahead and fit. I got to get into that ship first. Duh. So let's go ahead. Ship hanger. Assemble ship. Let's name it. Tin can. All right. Let's go ahead and get inside it. Oh, I can't. That's right. So what I'm going to do is I got my million skill points here. Go ahead and pause this. And we are going to apply skill points. Yep. All right, skill catalog. Spaceship. Kaldari. Let's go ahead. I don't know why I did that. Because I'm just going to go like this. We'll give it level two and then we will let it just kind of start going from there. Perfect. All right. And while we're at it, let's just go ahead and throw in frigate four as well. I'm sure we'll add more stuff in, but let's just go ahead and go with that. And so now we can get into tin can and let's fit that bad boy. All right. So we got that saved. And now well, let's see here. Let's go to. There we go. The agency. Missions. For epic arcs. There we go. And only 15 jumps. Let's set that as destination. And I'm going to go ahead and pause while I make the jump. A little longer than a few minutes later. Okay, and we are here. So we're going to start our first epic arc. And a beacon beckons. So we're going to get, oh, not bad. 200 and some thousand right off the bat. 
All right, so what do we got to do? We got to approach wretch wrecked ships. All right. Man, they're really pushing those up. Actually, yeah, ever marks. But those are really only worth anything. Ooh, diamond rats. I don't think I can take them. So let's set our destination. Okay, good. Only a couple jumps over. And off we go. I've got preloaded um, thorium charges. So 25 kilometer max range, 20 optimal. And we have a few different here. So I really don't know what's going to be worthwhile and what isn't. Um, so we're just going to go and see. We may have to add ammo as we go, depending on what we're fighting and everything else. Now, our goal is not to lose this ship because I spent just about everything I have on it. I've got remaining 466 K. So now technically I could come back from that just doing missions and stuff, but I am hoping that I won't have to. So we are going to warp off if we come up against something that seems to be too hard. And um, we'll see how it goes. Now, again, this is pretty much a brand new character. I have logged in four times. And I really only have... I've got um, one million allocated, unallocated. So I really only have 559 thousand skill points so this character is not even at a true 1 million skill points so this is really a brand new character more or less i've only trained up the skills for enforcer and for soldier of fortune so that give me a little bit of dps damage as i do things all right so it has been forever and a day or as some like to say, a hot minute since I have done the epic arc. And so let's see how it goes. I know it's a lot of warping around. And so I'll try to go ahead and save you the trouble of watching me warp around. So when it's going to be longer jumps, I'll go ahead and pause so you don't have to sit through it. All right, so it said to approach. So that's what we're going to do. I love this here. A lot of times it gives us exactly what we need. So let's go ahead, give it some afterburner love here so we can get there a little bit quicker. I don't think I'm going to have to fight anybody. I think I've just got to go here, look at these things, and then... Um, go talk to somebody afterwards. So hopefully everything will kind of be here in this system. Don't, 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 don't. Come on. Camel. Whoa, that wasn't exactly what I wanted to do. Oh, okay. We can complete this remotely. So we got there. All right. So 231 plus. We're going to request a mission. And so now we're going to get another 200 and some thousand looks like 200 even, or is that a 180? I can't quite tell. So we need to report to Tevis Jack. All right. So we're going to go ahead and accept remotely. And we're going to set our destination and it's just next door. So let's go off. Ooh. Tempest. Well, I was going to say nice, but uh, yeah, it's a wreck, so not nice, but I like the Tempest. Now, that might have been a nightmare there. I didn't look at it close enough. So, from what I remember, there's just a lot of traveling for this. It does have some missions, and you do got to kill things and all that, but there is a lot of traveling. All right, so we need to warp to our location. 
Now, I don't believe I had this the last time I um, did this, so it made it a lot more difficult trying to figure out what to do sometimes. So that'll be nice to have. All right, we got some other people here. Other people doing this mission. So we need to approach him. Let's start our conversation. We don't even have to approach. All right. So we are going to acquire these goods. So, all right. Set our destination. One over. Okay, so did it give it to us? No. All right. And away we go. I really like, I forgot how much I liked some of these frigates. This one looks pretty cool. Yeah, they're kind of nice. And I forgot, it's kind of fun to fly frigates. Every once in a while in Null Suck we'll do, um, I guess it's not a frigate destroyer, but we don't do too many Desis or frigates. Generally cruisers and above for our fleets. Okay, so warp to the location. We got bootlegger here. Kill five Triglavians and get 5,000 skill points. That doesn't seem quite worth it. Kill two NPCs, they get a thousand Evermarks, and mine some ore. Oh. We got some other ships. Yep, that is a nightmare. Nice. Oh, Na Nagelfar, okay. And that looks like, yep, Revelation. All right. Whoa. All right, I'm not even paying attention here. I got some things killing me, so let's go ahead. Let's... Put on those. Actually, let's get some antimatter charges here. I was too busy looking at the big ships. No, I'm not sure. I've got to loot one of them, so let's go ahead and turn around. I have max range of 17. So we're going to go ahead and orbit this guy at like a thousand. And we'll take these guys out. I definitely killed my two for those whole thousand Evermarks. And um, I'm not even in a corpse, so I don't even know what I would use it for. All right. Not in that. Definitely not in that one. All right, so let's orbit you at 10. Let's take you out. You're farther off now, so let's take you out. And let's take you out. Oh, okay, so they automatically give it to me. All right, so I'm not going to bother looting anybody else. So let's set our destination. And let's go turn that bad boy in. Now let's turn these off. Don't need those anymore. Yeah, I really do like this little ship.
13 hours until Kaldor Destroyer 3. Oh, watch out. It's a bootlegger. It's a bootlegger. Smile, bud. You're famous. Bootlegger's following me. All right, so... Warp 2 location. At least the nice thing right now is I'm not having to travel very far in between. All right. So we will, I think, talk remotely, have start conversation. Because I remember the first time I did this, I didn't know I had to talk to the guy. And I was just sitting there waiting around. All right, so. There we go. 215,000 there. So we are already up and over a million from where we were at. So request mission. And we are going to retrieve red. Okay. So destroy pirates, find red, and bring them back. All right, so. Okay, good. It's right here. Rifter, nice ship. Nice ship. I like the Rifter. A few moments later. All right. I um, had some wife aggro there, and instead of hitting mute, I hit pause. And so I went ahead and um, finished that uh, mission. And when I killed the ship, it went ahead and put red in my cargo hold and I just turned it in so I am gonna go ahead and stop here so so far not too bad I started this out with four hundred and forty six um, thousand and I am up to 1.3 so if you were wondering if you could make some isk off of the sisters of Eve you definitely can um, now I really don't know if it's any better than just doing level one missions and working your way into level two. I don't remember offhand, but I mean, so far it's been pretty good. I haven't spent a whole lot of time. I've already got a little over a mill built up or actually just a little bit under a mill built up. And so, um, it's been going pretty good. So this concludes episode two of my race to 100 million isk. I am doing this in an alpha pilot, and um, so you can do this too. Um, if you enjoy this video, please press that like button, subscribe, and hit the notifications so you're notified when new videos come up. And that also lets YouTube know how I'm doing, and it lets me know. Um, I will continue to try to provide good content. I love Eve. It's an amazing game and I love to share it with others. So, as always, fly dangerous.